The Trump administration on the offensive tonight after taking a hit today. A federal judge has given the impeachment inquiry a legal endorsement. While the Justice Department has launched a criminal investigation into why the Russia probe started. KCAL 9's Jeff Nguyen is here, has details for us. Jeff? Well, Jeff and Sharon, the White House is dealing with a major blow tonight, and this comes after a federal judge ruled today the impeachment inquiry is legitimate. On top of that, the court decided that Congress should have access to previously sealed material from the Mueller investigation. I had a perfect conversation with the president of Ukraine. Perfect. As the snowball effect of the impeachment inquiry grows, CBS News has learned attorneys for former National Security Advisor John Bolton are talking with lawmakers about possibly cooperating. The president fired Bolton last month. He wasn't getting along with people in the administration that I consider very important. Other witnesses have testified Bolton was concerned about the efforts to press Ukraine to investigate the president's political rivals. Sources also say regular impeachment strategy meetings have been held in the Situation Room, and the White House is looking to beef up its impeachment communications team. I don't have teams. Everyone's talking about teams. I'm the team. I did nothing wrong. But the Trump administration is also going on the offensive. The president has long insisted the investigation into Russian interference in the 2016 election was meant to keep him from winning the White House. And now the Justice Department has opened a criminal investigation. Whether it's Strzok and Page, whether it's Clapper and whether it's Comey and all of these people, because terrible things went on for our country. The probe allows the DOJ to subpoena witness testimony and documents and impanel a grand jury to possibly file criminal charges. If somebody has nothing to hide about what they were doing leading up to the 2016 election, then they have nothing to worry about. House Committee Chairs Jerry Nadler and Adam Schiff issued a joint statement reading, these reports, if true, raise profound new concerns that the Department of Justice under Attorney General William Barr has lost its independence and become a vehicle for President Trump's political revenge. In the meantime, the president claims deep state officials wanted to prevent his election. It looks like it's becoming very serious from what I'm hearing. Investigate the investigators. Now, the White House will likely appeal today's court ruling over the secret grand jury evidence gathered by that Mueller investigation. Jeff, we'll send it back to you. All right, All right Jeff, thanks very much.